All right. I have a lot of respect for people who have uh, innovative thoughts. I've had a lot of people with not an original thought in their life copy my stuff. When I see stuff like this, I got a lot of respect. This is very nicely executed. Well done design. Uh, my hat's off. Very cool. Uh, we know. used to do a very similar thing where we tried to make this gun as good as it could be. We twisted the action in the stock 120 degrees, putting the feed tube on top, barrel on the right. We called it a pump twist dual. It had a dual CO2. It had a pump action where we took the front part of the wood, split it from the back, put a dowel it could ride on, and the front of the pump was act or the front of the stock was actually your pump. And so the the twist meant we pushed it 120 degrees to the right, recut the slots for the trigger group, and recut the pin for the the back group to pin in, and then we uh, dual CO2 the gun so it would have more CO2 capacity. What year do you think was that? Um, well, after the rifles arrived, so it must have been 88 or 86 or 87, right in there, because yeah. they there was 200 rifles, mm -hmm. and we wound up we wound up working on an awful lot of them because yeah. they really needed dual CO2 to be. Uh -huh effective or they needed some sort of constant error they uh -huh. they didn't get enough shots from a 12 gram to be usable yeah. but uh, it was a good gun good platform <laughs>